Mindful meditation, so widely recognized and practiced now in the West, is based on the Noble Eightfold Path of Buddhism. The Theravada tradition is characterized by meditative seclusion in forests and nature to fully realize the liberated mind. It also includes community engagement, service, and teaching. I was ordained in the first wave of the revival of the Theravada Bhikkhuni Sangha. I initiated and co-founded Tamadrini Vihara 10 years ago, which was the first temporary Bhikkhuni Vihara in the Western United States. There are so many women who aspire to ordain here in the West as well as in the Theravada homelands. And there are many people who want Bhikkhuni teachers. They feel the value of our unique contribution to their lives and practice and Buddhism's contribution to the presence of wisdom, deep meditation, and ethical integrity in our communities and in our world. The doors to our first Dhammadrini Vihara opened in August 2005. It was one of the first independent communities in the West where women could live and practice as bhikkhunis, fully ordained monastics in the Theravada tradition of Buddhism. I was looking for a path of liberation for opening the heart, uh, freedom, and within the Theravada Buddhist teachings I found that. And to find a monastic community of women practicing for liberation, that was joy. It is very important for us to have a place like this Bhikkhuni Vihara. This is a place for our children to cultivate their compassion in this disconnected world. Over the last 10 years, I've served as preceptor for 28 women. Now, we wish to not only ordain the women and then send them abroad to places that will support them. We wish to grow a local monastic community and the support base here in the USA and abroad to nurture and cultivate these new monastics, wise and liberated women. This vision, the place to do this, is our Bhikkhuni Monastery. It's been our plan from the beginning and it's our next step. I hope you'll join us.